Hi, Bees and Curls, it's Melissa. Welcome back. If this is your first time, I wanna welcome you. If this is your second, third, fourth time, you already know you're an OG and your family. If you are new to the channel, I just wanna say welcome. Come in, take a seat, eat some chicken, as I said, but that just means to relax and come in and chill. I'm like Netflix and chill, okay? Today's video is going to be another top five, another one. Yeah, we're gonna talk about five products that I use as leave-ins that bring some deep moisture for high porosity hair. Now, I do know that a lot of these do work for low porosity hair girls too. So, if you're a low porosity girl and you like any of these, Go ahead and let me know down in the comment section. I'm sure somebody else would love the information. But because I am high porosity, I'm going to go ahead and let you know what are my favorites to winterize. And these are some power packed leave-ins. I absolutely love these products. So let's jump right in. Okay, so we're going to start with an Odie and a Goodie. This one you've seen in my deep conditioner, but I also use it as a leave-in. This is the Curl Junkie Curl Rehab. This is amazing 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 leave-in now this is my ride or die it was in my ride or die tag for curly hair this is a ride or die product i'm telling you you can use it as a leave-in you can use it as a deep conditioner it's an og hello it's in the 32 ounce y'all whenever i get this i don't even get the eight ounce anymore i was like what's the use Missy Palo is like, girl, please. So this is amazing. It gives deep, deep moisture. That's how you know that this is an amazing product is if you leave it in your hair, it's bomb. If you, when you rinse it out, you don't even necessarily have to use a shower cap or a, a um, plastic cap. It, it, you don't even have to be under the dryer for this to penetrate. Now, if you want some deep penetration, go ahead and get under that dryer, use your Q-Redo, but this is amazing i'm telling you i know that there are low low porosity girls that love this but high porosity high porosity get this so i've used this a couple of times and i absolutely love this this is definitely what i am going to go into the winter months using this is the jaden moon vanilla cookies hair butter now it says it's a hair butter but let me tell you it's a moisturizer butter Okay, the first ingredient is water. Whenever I see that first ingredient being water, that means that that is the main ingredient. It's going to moisturize my hair. Second ingredient is coconut oil. So this is the thing that, you know, the Curl Rehab, I could recommend to low porosity. This, I don't know because the second ingredient is coconut oil and some people can get that protein overload but high porosity hair loves protein. So I absolutely love this product. If you are looking for something with no coconut oil, I highly recommend, I don't even know if all of it's like no coconut oil at all, but the Curl Rehab, I know that there are some low porosity gals that I know love that product. But this is the Vanilla Cookies and I love this. I absolutely love this. This is something that I can actually put in my hair by itself, meaning that I can just, this is like one step leave in. No styler, like after wash and go, I can seal with this and moisturize. This is a, it's heavy. I wouldn't use it as a daily moisturizer, but to that one stop after on soaking wet hair, putting this in, it is magical. Magical. Sprinkling. The Jada Moon Hair Butter Vanilla Cookies is amazing. Love this. I have not come with the deep. I'm opening this because my other one is gone. This is Darcy Botanicals. Sweet Cocoa Bean Curling Smoothing Cream. This stuff is good. The pumpkin seed conditioner is really good too, but I love this sweet cocoa. Now, let me tell you something. If you are transitioning, this is an amazing product. I used this when I was transitioning. I'm going to come with my like natural hair journey because I realized I looked at all my videos. I was like, I have not talked about my entire like my natural hair journey. I need to tell y'all. But anyway, this is so good. It's a moisturizing smoothing cream for natural curls and waves. And this first ingredient 
is water. Second ingredient is cocoa butter. See, that's what I, I, I don't know. It's just my hair gravitates and says, uh, yes, give it to me with these. So this is the Sweet Cocoa Curl Smoothing Cream. If you, like I said, this is a great transitioning cream. I believe Darcy can, I think Darcy Botanicals actually has a transitional cream and I use that as well, but the Sweet Cocoa Bean is a great product as well. It's going to get, to me, for my hair, it gave some hold. Now, for these, I highly recommend if you are half, if you are high porosity and have fine thin hair, is to use this sparingly. Use this in sections. You can use it all over your hair, but I go in sections with any of these products and I maybe wait a day or two before I got start that moisturizing and sealing right routine that I do at night. But absolutely love this sweet cocoa bean smoothing cream. Camille Rose Curlate Moisture Butter. I talked about this in my November favorites. I absolutely love this. This is a notch up to me. And when I say notch up, look at this. It is so buttery that it molded itself to the lid. I love my Almond Jai. Now I can use that in the winter too, but this is more, it, this is deeper butters. This is like going into the, this is more on the butter side than the moisture side. And I feel like the Almond Jai Twist Butter is kind of like a, a really good medium between the two, between moisturization and oils and butters. That's the Almond Jai Twist Butter. But this one is the Curl Aid Moisture Butter. I can use this by itself. The cocoa bean I can use by itself as well. And this is what I love about these products. The only one that I probably would not use by itself is a curl rehab. I would need to go in with an oil, but that one still packs so much with moisture. Oh, epic. But this is really, really good. I was really impressed. And first ingredient is water. Second, rice milk, BTMS, acetyl alcohol, and then coconut oil. So if you are low porosity, I, if this is not working for you, it's probably because the, you know, coconut oil is high on the list and this may be giving you protein overload. I will definitely come and talk about protein versus moisture overload. And um, let me know if you guys want to hear about that, if you're having that issue. But this is the Camilla Rose Curlant Moisture Butter. I absolutely love this too. I love the Curl Rehab. That's an OG. But I think, especially during the winter time, I love this one a bit more. This one takes the place of like everything, okay? Because it is so packed with moisture. And if you want your curls to pop, pop, then you want to get this. This is the Curl Friend Smoothie. Now, this is my 16 ounce. My eight ounce is almost gone. And I was talking to the owner today hallelujah thank you jesus it is in a jar now because look girlfriend this bottle is one of the most heavy duty bottles that i have ever come in encounter with and this stuff is so good that i want to cut open this bottle and get every last bit of this but i'm so glad it's in a jar right now and in the future not too long from that from this video i'm going to be having a giveaway and the Curl Friend Smoothie is going to be in there. So look out because this is amazing. I love this. Like this one has the butters lower on the list. It has mango butter. My hair loves that. That's the main one in here. But there's also sunflower seed oil. But this one is heavy. Silk amino acids. It makes the hair really, really soft. It is so good. It is so, so so good i've talked about this number a numerous amount of times even in la on last year it is amazing for winter and i can just only see in this being around a long time yeah so those are my favorites let me know what you are loving in the winter these are like winterized leave-ins okay i do have lighter leave-ins in the spring and the summer but because we are talking about these top five and we're in fall and winter i only thought it would be suitable to tell you all about this so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe on your way out hope you come back for more and i will see you in the next few days in another video 
Bye, love you.